He looks so sad. Set 47. I found something. Ooh. Buenos Aires International Airport this morning. Now watch this. Harold. Trail ends at the airport, but turns out that a top Providence operative owns a vineyard in the area. Don Yates, of infamous New York law firm Morgan Yates and Cohn. And get this, it's hosting his retirement party today. She's infiltrated them. She's sending a message. She needs my help. Could have fooled me. You don't know her. Anyway, if you're going after her, you'll need to deal with the Herald. Her name's Tamara Vidal, former CIA asset and political firebrand. She's a master of surveillance and the Constance's most trusted aide. She'll have eyes everywhere. You won't get far as long as she's in the game. Why are you telling me this? I thought you were out. Yeah. Old habits, I guess. Ooh. Anyway, I... I need to go. See you around, 47. No. You won't. What? Apparently not. All right. Let's talk about our stuff. I don't know why the ICA-19 is it. We always use a custom 5mm. Yeah, we'll probably need that. And you know what? Actually, I don't think we'll need that. What we should do... Just a lethal syringe, because we can. Oh, by the way, hello, my fellow gamers. Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Hitman World of Assassination. Last time, we had fun in the big city of China. Big trouble in little China. Now, we get to see our old friend that you can kill. That we're not going to. Because that'd be rude. There's a lot of people with guns here. Because you're not an idiot. Let's just humor him. Yates likes his little games. Don't be long. Crazy lady's crazy. You got my message. You'd never get caught on camera. Not unless you wanted to be seen. So what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next constant. I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Ooh. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. The Herald, Tamara Vidal. She has eyes everywhere, and they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my side for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. No. I'm a dad. Here, I got you an invitation, just like old times. Well, thank Don't you. Find me when it's done. Good luck, 47. Uh, that car just started to move for no reason. Oh my gosh, be careful. The ground's super loose here. If we fall, we're just uh, I'm not finishing that sentence. So how's everyone doing today? We are going to kill two more people because they deserved it. Allegedly. Uh huh. Been living alone here. Bienvenidos to Viñeda Yates, senor. May I see your invitation, please? Yeah, sure, why not? Gracias, senor. Enjoy the party. Looking good, looking good. Thank you. Would you care for an aperitif? You know what? Yeah. Thank you. So, you must know everything that goes on at the event. Care to give me the lowdown? Mm, let's see. Most of the guests have already arrived. And let me tell you, it's like a Forbes 500 convention in there. Most are high profile clients of Morgan, Yates, and Cole. But the Yates are still no shows. 
word hmm. is, they're still up at the house. They haven't made an entrance yet. Curious. Any idea what? Well, I probably shouldn't be saying this, but word is that Yates was in a great mood this morning, but that all changed when the letter arrived. The letter? letter? Yeah. An honest-to-God letter delivered by courier. I mean, who writes letters anymore? Anyway, it must have been bad news because Senor Yates heard the plant off the balcony. Big heavy one, too. It almost hit Isabel, one of the maids who had to go lie down. Oh. Anything else? The party is not the only thing happening at the estate. The winery is open for guests, too. You should check it out if you're interested in wine later. It's harvest season, after all. I might just do that. Thank you for your time, Miss. Right. Oh, that he just puts a full glass down that he never really touched. All right, so make me. So the weirdest part is there's zero. It was the most stories that I. This is like the point. This I could not find anything. Okay, I didn't forget the Asado torch. What's this? Control panel. I almost blew up the whole game. Really? that noise? Huh? What was that noise? Yep, Tom. I'm a nice waiter, after all. You seem nervous. You got something? What's up, yo? What's up? It's my turn. I gotta go visit stuff in here. Wanna pass? I check your pockets. That's not up for discussion. Okay. Check my pockets. I got nothing Maybe to hide. No need to flex. You ain't got to impress me. I let his hands just okay, go man. right Mama. through the uh, apron. So one of our guys is back here. Ooh, this is a fun scenario. This isn't going away, my love. It falls on me as constant. Can I, like, just say screw it? Oh, this may be one of those hyper aggressive episodes ever. Oh. Dang it. Well, we have guards. We could probably take a guard out, steal his uniform, and invade. And honestly, let's do that. It's never a bad idea to be a guard. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why. I got out of bed at all. Why does shit like this? Ah. You know what, for the heck of it? Hmm? 
This guy knows I'm not. Yeah, command, there's some kind of commotion down here. Have a look around. Yeah, have a look around. Oh, that was close. Alright. All my coin back. And let's go invade Senor Yates' property. Man, there are people everywhere that know who I am. Your letter. I merely called to express my regrets that you were not able to make it to the party. Rest assured that I will extend our new herald the warmest of welcome. A most shrewd and gentleman move on your part, bringing her into the fold. I have the utmost confidence that Miss Burnwood will prove a valuable addition to the group. Feel free to call me at your leisure. Have a good day. <laughs> machine. Since when do I get the machine? Should probably hit her a little bit better. I. Oh, they didn't even check. Why did nobody check for that? Well, this makes things interesting. So I decided to just go ahead and have some fun here. Or painful ass, so I can do the old fashioned way. No lo creo. It should be on. This was locked. So, what's going on in the basement? Shall we see? Probably an easy way down. Ooh, those guys know I'm not me. Okay, this is nice to know if I ever play this level again, I can just come through a... ...whole different area. Well, what else is an option? What are you people? <laughs> huh. What is? Oh, I thought I got a story. The boss. Duty calls. Let me guess, the Burnwood woman. That's right. Gates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Wants you to tag along. Not for my sparkling personality. This Burnwood woman sure has his panties in a twist. Wonder what the deal is. Hmm. His business is his business. Just get yourself ready and sign into the visitor center. Oh. Uh have a drink on my behalf. I don't drink. Makes me sentimental. A private tour of the estate. Diana, Vidal, and this fixer, Corvo Black. Black is a threat, but also an opportunity. Yates's own machinations are inconsequential. Joining the tour will give access to Vidal, away from the crowd. Him reading his thing is very... Dark. I'm gonna borrow this one. Nothing quite spoils the party like the guests' 
I wonder where this person's going, because it's... Are you going up? Hey, look, a QR code. I do have one coin left. But I gotta find a way to get... I'm more of a beer man myself, but if Yates wants to bring the heralds closer together and play the modern boss, I, I don't actually What are you doing, my friend? Hmm? What was that noise? Why'd you go check it out, man? Yep, Tom. That was... I'm gonna... Move him a little bit more in, just in case someone randomly sees him. Alright, that was very smooth, and this could be one of the fastest missions we ever did. I was about to get very... Uh... Ha! Huh. Well, Corval Black, I'm on the tour. Right, Mr. Black, welcome. Miss Burnwood and Miss Vidal will meet you down by the wine fields. I trust you know the way. I can find my way around. Enjoy the tour. All right, that was easy enough. Now I just gotta. One of the most surveillance specials ever to grab. Just gotta find my way down there. Well, there's stairs over there. All oh, the stairs right here. This, uh, Schwindig is very... Oh, my God. What? Dang, they, they know, uh, a lot. Hey. What's up? Over here. You two. Must be Burnwood and Vidal. And you must be Yates's garbage man. Sorry, but I didn't catch your name. This is Corvo Black, Tamara. He's the ICA regular. I only work with the best. Well, we're all here, it seems. Except for our guide, the chief winemaker. Looks like we're stuck here until someone fetches him. Mr. Black, I'm looking in your direction. Hold on. I'll track him down. At a boy. We try and bring him back in one piece. Johannesburg. Counter and field with us. That was a bit rude. Yes. Yes, it was. Ah, uh, I gotta play sneaky, sneaky through grape bonds. What? What is he now? What? You have some guests waiting. Senor Yates wanted you to give them the grand tour. Remember? If I don't have food in for them, he's a baby with Yates socialized friend. It's only harvest season. Better do what he says, Patron. Big shot New York lawyer like that. Well, I'm not going anywhere until I have decided if he's talking to us. Bring me the three more big grapes. Yates doesn't like how I prioritize. If you weigh me down with concrete, he told me of a bridge. How's that? It's one do it. I'll get my picking knife. On the back of my neck, he's all pretty. I hate big ones. Now, what am I doing here? What am I? I left it right here. Seriously, who takes another map? What? Uh oh, more than one oh. person heard that. Is anyone there? No. No. We'll dump him in here, and we'll change his clothes. Alright. 
a great picking knife. I've never heard of one of these. Oh god, you're no, I'm not me. Well, I don't know I'm me either. Alright, so we have... I don't know what those are. What? Hey, excelente. Uh, shears. I don't. The game usually gives me something to work with. And there's nothing to work with. Why is there so many people that, like, will give me away here? Damn. Why were you going? Well, dude, you, yeah, and you're in the way. Give you the grape. Mr. Vargas, I have the three grapes you requested. Yes, good. Bring them here. Mm -hmm. Good size. Large and firm. Brown. Excellent. Dude's mustache is killer. Sweet. Right for harvest. Before the work is, use your ammonia. I have a target. Will do. Oh, I can just jump back over here. <laughs> that was pretty painless. Lovers. Hello! Welcome to Vineda Yates. I do apologize for the delay, but the Malbec grape is a demanding mistress. So, I am Gabriel Vargas, chief one maker, and I will be your tour guide. Any questions before we start? Yes, but you're not going to like them. I, uh... We're good. Lead the way, Senor Vargas. Wonderful. Follow me. These are busy times. In fact, we're just about to harvest this year's crop. Great expectations. So, how do you like up? Argentina? Like everywhere else. That? Full of Americans. First stop on the tour is the production floor, where our prize winning Malbec grapes are processed. We insist on steaming every grape by hand, which means that during harvest season, the grapes do tend to pile up. Luckily, we have plenty of storage space. Our equipment is state of the art. Including an industrial sized freezer unit, and last but not least, a trusty grape crusher. I know how to kill her. Wouldn't you say, Mr. Black? Follow me, please. Why are you like. Are you a wine man, Black? Somehow you don't seem the type. 
Oh, I believe Mr. Black here is something of a jack of all trades. Isn't that so? I dabble. I see. I just thought Yates might be sending a message. My mistake. So, have any of you been to our vineyard before? Only on business. Next on our tour is the fermentation atrium, where the wine goes to its primary stage of fermentation. In these big open tanks, yeast converts the sugars in the wine to alcohol in a process that lasts between 5 and 15 days. Not bad. This is also where we squeeze the mass into a fine juice using our grape presser for the longer secondary stage of fermentation. I want to use grape presser. Now, before we move on... I have a question. It's... Perhaps we can take a closer look. Certainly. Lead the way. What can you tell me about this device? Grape presser, was it? That is correct, senor. The primary fermentation, the mass is pressed through a fine filter, leaving only the flesh and skins behind. I should add, the grape stomping, the iconic practice of crushing grapes with your bare feet, is historically red and mostly a tourist gimmick. But you are most welcome to try. Imagine you're a grape. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I'll pass. Go on. I'll take a picture of the three of you. Oh, come on, Tamara. When in Rome. Fine. Oh. I want to use the great pressure, but I'll kill Diana. I'm not just a killer. So. May I see that, Mr. Vargas? I believe I blinked. Hold on a sec. Do you recognize me? Oh no! What happened to her? Oh dear. I gotta find my way out now. <laughs> I was really hoping you could use the great pressure to crush her to kill him. We're talking knee deep. What? Uh where's there an exit at? <laughs> there's only one exit. I wonder why there's only one. And why is it locked? Okay, now it's on. Oh, wait, how did you get up here? Well, Vidal is nothing if not unpredictable. And dead. 47? All right, how you betraying me? It's done. Now what? Now, we strike at the heart. Edwards. You know how to find him, don't you? Why, Edwards finds you, 47. He is untraceable, and he never lets you forget it. He is cocky, and that will be his downfall. What's the plan? Too many eyes. Meet me at the Olive Grove at sunset. One last tango, 47. Uh, that's cute. I actually do like that ending. That was a very... Four stars. Right? I'm counting four. Maybe. Okay. Didn't get it perfect. I'll take three. I expected doing a little bit better than that, but. A Trank Blaster Gun? That thing's massive.
How did you know? Your deal. That kind of power always comes with a price. What's yours? I think you know. I am sorry. This is a necessary evil. What have you done? Eat the brand neurotoxin. Transfers by touch. Oh. So Edwards learns by his mistakes, 47. And as you've clearly demonstrated, brute force is futile. It had to be me. It was the only way. To get this close. My family. I know what you did. After all these years, I finally know. I am sorry. You didn't have a choice. I did. Providence used you, but I'm no better. All I saw was a blank slate, a weapon to wield. I told myself it was what you needed, but people aren't meant to be controlled. This is a kindness. Goodbye, Agent. Rude? Wait, that's just how it ends? Next time on Hitman World of Assassination, we become untouchable. I'll see you then.